question number two you are told to name the organelle that perform each of the following functions in a cell a transport of packaged glycoprotein that one is gogi bodies or you can also call them gogi apparatus b uh, the organelles that uh, perform the destruction of worn out cell organelles that one is lysomes uh, organelle that silences uh, the protein that one is ribosomes question number three you are told uh, some form one student wanted to collect the following animals for study in the laboratory so the suitable operator they should use uh, for flying insect is sweep net uh, for glory uh, crawling uh, stinging insect that one is a pair of forceps uh, number four a small animal from three back that one is a puta question number four you are told the uh, study the diagram below and answer the questions that follow you can see this one here this one is a, a, a diagram you can see it has a starch green it has part labeled a b it has a, a fat lipid droplets you are told to identify the structure labeled A and B. A and B. And that one A is a stroma, B is a granum. So this one is a stroma, then one, the other one is a granum. Question number B What process takes place in the part labeled A and B? A, this one is carbon for oxide fixation. B, here, that one what takes place there is the process of photosynthesis question number five state three environmental factors that increase the rate of transpiration that one is number one high light intensity number two high temperature number three strong wind number four low humidity and number the last one is low atmospheric pressure we thank you so much for watching this video watch the other part and next uh, uh, video let's go to section b uh we request you to subscribe if you have not yet subscribed to this channel uh, to the subscribers we request you one thing kindly uh, like this video and it will be recommended to other viewers across the world question number 14 you are told the diagram below represent a traverse section through a plant organ and uh, you're told uh, you first of all look at the organ or the diagram look at how part j part k, k part l uh, part m you're told from which uh, plant organ was the section obtained that one is root then number two you're told give reason give two reasons for your answer in a above why have you seen it is a root organ and because there is presence of root airs you can see them and there is presence of endodermis uh, you can see that one a uh, presence of a uh, star shaped uh, 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 presence of xylem a uh, star shaped at the center you can see it there then presence of phylum at the arms of the xylem is the the phylum this one is xylem let's go to the next question name the part labeled j k and l j k and l and um, j is epidermis j is epidermis k is phylum l l is here is xylem Let's go to the next one state two functions of the part labeled m part labeled m part labeled m is here and uh, what is the function of this part labeled m the function of that one uh, is to absorption of water and absorption of mineral salt which number 15 a, solu uh, a solution of sugarcane was boiled with hydrochloric acid a sodium carbonate was heated with the benedict solution an orange precipi precipitate was formed why was the solution boiled with hydrochloric acid this question they keep on repeating it so 
it is good for you to uh, master it. Why was the solution boiled with hydrochloric acid? This is to hydrolyze or break down the disacrylates uh, uh, that is non reducing sugars. Number two, you are told to which class of carbohydrates does does sugar in sugar can belong that one is non reducing sugar your tool number c name the type of reaction that took place when simple sugars combine to form a complex sugar that one is a condensation uh, uh, the type of reaction that take place when uh, a complex uh, sugar is broken into simple sugars that one is hydrolysis then you are told to state uh, the form in which carbohydrates are stored in plant is stored in starch. Roman 2 in animals is stored as glycogen. Let's go to the next question. What do you expect to observe if starch was used instead of juice from a sugar can explain? The color of Benedict solution would be retained. The starch cannot reduce the Benedict solution. Question number 16. You're told uh, the diagram below shows a setup that was used to demonstrate fermentation. You can see the setup here. We have glucose solution and yeast suspension. We have oil layer. We have delivery tube. We have lime water. You are told and glucose solution this one was boiled and oil added on the top of it the glycogen solution was then allowed to cool before adding yeast suspension you're told why was the glycogen solution boiled before adding the yeast What was the importance of cooling the glucose solution before adding the suspension? Uh, this one is to avoid killing yeast cells or denaturing of enzymes in the yeast cells. Next, you are told what was the use of the oil in the experiment? Oil was used to prevent air from getting into the yeast and glucose suspension mixture. Next, you are told to state the observation at the end of the experiment. The lime water formed a white precipitate. Uh, question by E, you are told to give two reasons why accumulation of lactic acid during vigorous exercise led to an increase in heart beat. This one is to supply oxygen, to supply oxygen uh, to break down lactic acid. Next, you are told to other than carbon dioxide, name the other product of an anaerobic respiration in a plant. That one is alcohol and energy. Question number 17. You're told to name any three defects of the circulation, the circulatory system in a human. Name any three defects of the circulatory systems a circulatory system in humans uh, these defects are thrombosis number two very coarse veins next atri atriosclerosis we have atriosclerosis we have written uh, that one then uh, hypertension uh, question b you are told to state the adaptation of the red blood cells to their function and they keep on repeating this one uh, they are become cave in shape Two, increase surface for diffusion of gases. Number two, they have hemoglobin, which has the high affinity for oxygen. Next, they have thin walls to shorten uh, diffusion distance. Then the last one, uh, presence of carbonic uh, and hydrase, which is involved in the transportation of carbon dioxide. Next. 
you are told name bland versus which with the, with the highest concentration of glucose that one is hepatic pata vein next one high concentration of carbon dioxide that one is pulmonary artery what is the importance of of tissue fluid uh, tissue fluid uh, is a medium of exchange of substances between bland and bond tissues question number 18 the diagram below represent part of human digestive system you can see this part and uh, from the part n m p you have a k l you are told question number one name the organs labeled l l you can see it here is duodenum uh, b <coughs> name the enzymes found in uh, the in, in the juice secreted by part labeled m uh, and you are told state the food substance uh, they digest so the enzyme is pancreatic, pancreatic amylase and the digest is starch then we have tri trypsin that one digest protein lipids uh, digest uh, lipids A question number b you are told state the three features of the part labeled p that increase the surface area uh, features that increase the surface area number one presence of villi and microvilli so this part here it has <coughs> it has villi and microvilli that increase the surface area number two it is long you can see it is very long and then the last one it is it is very long so these are the the features that make it able to increase the surface area for absorption of food let's go to section c we are almost through and i uh, we are told to describe the process of inhalation in human being inhalation that is breathing in uh, so what happens uh, you are told to describe that process the process of breathing in so what happens is that the external intercostal muscles contract while internal intercostal muscles relax uh, pulling the cage upwards and outwards muscles of diaphragm contract causing the diaphragm to flatten this movement increases the volume of thoracic cavity reducing uh, the pressure of the thoracic cavity compared to atmospheric pressure this causes the atmospheric air to rush into the lungs through the nostrils and the lungs uh, inflate uh, so this uh, this time they are asking you uh, the process of breathing in next time they can ask you the process of breathing out these are the the, the technical terminologies you use uh, external intercostal muscle you use uh, rib cage you use diaphragm you use um, thoracic cavity and so on and so forth uh, last question for today you are told describe the opening of stomata using the uh, photosynthetic uh, process uh, you are told to describe that how does that process happen uh, through the process of uh, photosynthesis so our explanation is gut cells have a uh, chloroplast in the presence of light uh, photosynthesis occur in gut cells producing sugar in the gut cells osmotic pressure of the gut cell cells increase increases uh, than that of adjacent epidermal cells water from neighboring adjacent cells enter into the gut cell by osmosis uh, causing a turgidity of gland cells which bulges outwards